Hey guys. Um, so I have just gotten back from my mammals. Um, we I would say there the whole weekend, and we had Red Bo- Robin twice. So, so that's why I haven't been uh, recording any, making any videos, um, for the past weekend, because I've been in West Virginia. My mom didn't come, so so it was just me and Mammal. It wasn't Sam and Mike. So, yeah, um, my sister just made her first video today, so go check out her channel. It's, it's, you, if, you might not like it if you're a boy, though. Just saying, because she's a sis, she's my sister. Alright, so, you, I told you guys I was going to try to get the player plushie or something, but none of the plushies that I wanted were there. It was, but... I found some pretty good plushies still. So I'm going to start out, before we get into FNAF, I'm going to start out with Mr. Boris. So, Mr. Boris. So, they, um, I had, my cousin had told me to get a Boris, because I had given, given him my Bendy. So, now every time we meet, I'll bring and Boris, and he can bring Bendy, and we can play. I can also bring some other of my plushies. So, yeah, well, well, we're gonna. So these are in a certain order. So, so for the origins. So I'm gonna do. Go ahead and do the origins, All right? So this is how I found them in order. So first, Jacko Chica. So we were. This is before we we ate out at Red Robin. So we we were in GameStop, and then um, we were usually their plushies are near the end of the store. Um, so we looked over there, um, and we found there. I think there was a Reaper Foxy, but I do not remember. And she was with him. I said, "Nope, I can't have Foxy. I have too many Foxies." I also made the right decision. I was, ve- I made a very good choice. Cause now, if I if I didn't pick Chica, then I couldn't, then I um, and I picked Dreadbear, then I couldn't get Chica, cause Chica wasn't at any of the other stores. So I made a right decision. So, yeah, but I can't. So. I, I, before we get on to the other origins, well, before I say what I'm going to say, um, Chica, I chose Chica out of the others, so, that was, Chica was the only one I got, um, and, now, before we get into Bonnie and Boris, um, I wanted to say, I am doing, uh, the Curse of Dreadbear, so, but you guys are probably asking, ask, gonna, wanting to ask me, well, Ryan, how are you going to do it without Reaper Foxy? Well, here's the thing. I want to see if I can make this these episodes each month. Or at least until I get some money so I can buy Reaper Foxy online. The best way to do it is buy him online. So, because I can't, I can't just go to every GameStop in the world. GameStops have, each different GameStops have different plushies. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Um, cause I think I'm, I'm gonna have to make this work perfectly to where, to where it makes sense, where Reaper Foxy will be in one part. So, yeah. Or I could just wait till I get a Reaper Foxy. Yeah, but then I can't, then these plushies won't be, won't be in my Rhino's plush world. So, yeah, I'll have to do that. All right now, moving on to Boris and Bonnie, the two, um, the two ones with the big ears. Actually, he's not big. He doesn't have big ears. So, so we were walking into our second GameStop. This is after we went to Red Robin, and I had a little cheeseburger and some French fries. They call them steak fries. And um, when we were going to GameStop. We walked in. There was Pokemon plushies first, and then we went to the back. There was some mediocre Melody plushies. Um, 
So, but I didn't want to get those because there was a. Well, I was planning on getting one of those until I saw him, the Jack O'Bonny. I was I was saying in the car. I think lots of people like Jack O'Bonny, and then I found him. So I'm pretty lucky now. So yeah, I chose him out of all of those. Now I wasn't going over to any of the other places because I I knew this was the only place that they had FNAF plushies, or like like you know. So I just I picked Jack O'Bonny, and I was having. Um, a decision between, what's the elephant's name? I keep on forgetting the elephant's name from Mediocre Melodies. Um, I'll figure it out later. Um, and Pig Patch. So it was the elephant dude and Pig Patch. Sorry if you guys are screaming at me because I do not know the elephant's name. I, 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 I always get confused with, well, I always, I always forget his name. So, I, I... I was going to choose, I think I was going to choose the elephant, um, so I went over, I went, I was walking over until I saw Boris, so now we're getting on to Boris, so I put pig, I think I put, actually no, that's not how it went, I didn't pick any of them, I didn't, I just wanted to see what other plushies there were before I made my decision, so I went over and I saw Boris, and, um, I think it it was the, and there was one more, there was one other, but I had, once I had saw that, I remember um, my cousin telling me to get Boris, and so I, I, I didn't, I, it was just an easy pick, Boris, obviously, so yeah, that's how I got him, so now every time my, me and my cousin meet, we can play with Benji and Boris, yay, alright, now time for Dreadbear, so, at, we had, we, um, we had gone, this is, was, when we had, before we, when, this was after we got home, and we, and we just stayed there for a little bit, Mamma was going to the mall, so, she asked me if I wanted to come, because I still had an extra ten bucks, so I said, yeah, and she, she was, she was surprised that I wanted to go, go out out and buy more plushies. Well, obviously, Mamma. <laughs> because I love plushies. You can't expect someone um to not buy a plushie if they have the opportunity that loves plushies. Like someone that loves plushies to do to not go to the store and buy more plushies with that money. I mean <laughs> Yeah. So so she was shopping for my sh some shoes for me and clothes. So me so while she was doing that, me and Pap, me and my Pap, we 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 were gonna go look for the GameStop. We were actually lucky enough to be right to go out the right exit and find GameStop right beside us. He was like, "Oh, I th I didn't know we were gonna get get there that quick." So we got in there and there was. Sadly, there was only two Dreadbear plushies, and there was no other plushies. But that's okay. Dreadbear's awesome. And, but there was also, like, Pokemon plushies, Mario plushies. I don't need them. I, I, I have, and I don't, I, honestly, I don't really like Pokemon. But, yeah. M you know, maybe, um... You guys can send me pictures of a Pokemon card, and I can try and draw it, and I can do a video... Of me drawing all of you guys' um, Pokemon cards. Okay? So that's probably what I'll do. If you guys are if you guys are mad that I don't like Pokemon. It's just not my thing. So yeah. So I've so I bought Dreadbear because he was the only uh, he was the only thing I could buy. I looked around for some other plushies just to make sure. And I there's no others. So yeah. That's when I got, I chose to get Dreadbear. Also got some candy at the end. And we found a Spongebob shirt, which I'm wearing right now. And two others, with a, and one, and some P, PJs. Um, my sister and my brother are outside playing with the pool noodles, so you guys might hear banging on the house. I don't know. I'm recording right now, and I can hear it, but I don't know if you guys can hear it. So, yeah. 
So yeah, that's it for the origins. Now, um, I'm gonna do voice lines. So Dreadbear, I'm still working on his. I don't even think he's just gonna have a voice in the on the Curse of Dreadbear. He's just gonna like mumble where you, you can't even understand him. Be super low. But when when he's um, he'll be like. You know, I'm actually kind of glad I got Dreadbear. You know why? He can be the grand. He can be the grandpa. <laughs> yeah, he can be the grandpa. And then Chica and Bonnie, um, like Jacko Chica and Jacko Bonnie, they're kind of like brother and sisters. They just argue a lot and fight and tackle each other. And then Morris is like, "Give me some soup." Yeah. <laughs> so like, uh, I was at Mamaw's house, and. Um, um, so we were playing hide and seek with these four, and Chica, um, Jacko Chica, um, I didn't know this, but I put her in the lamp, so, I had, I didn't know that it would start a fire, so, I learned something, and then Jacko Bonnie, he was, he was in the bathroom, using the bathroom, I'm gonna save Boris for last. Dreadbear was sleeping watching some Lanky Box. And Boris, the the craziest one, he locked him, he shut himself in the freezer and could in no, in the fridge and couldn't get out. He was looking for some soup. See, Boris is crazy for soup. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm gonna go through their voice lines. Alright, so Jacko Chica from the, so this is what she'll sound like in the Curse of Dreadbear. And Jack O'Bonnie just sounds the same. Just a little bit different. And then Boris. Hi. Can I have some soup? Something like that. And then Dreadbear from... Well, oh yeah. And then Chica, when she's not acting in the Curse of Dreadbear. Hey, Jack buddy. What, Jacko Chica? You want to go play? No, you're too ugly. <coughs> yeah, and then Dreadbear in the Curse of Dreadbear when he's acting. <coughs> Something like that. I'm gonna work on it for my next video, and then when he's when he's not acting. <coughs> hey, stunning boy. I want to hear a story how I became the FNAF Frankenstein Sunny Boy. It all began when I was a little kid. We're not getting into that. All right. So, yeah, that's all of them. So, let me set them back up. And, yeah, that's, that's all for Let's Talk Plush Episode 3. But I also want to show you guys one more thing before I let you guys go. So I do I do have some one little picture of Dreadbear that I want to show you guys that I worked hard on at my mammals. So I'm gonna go get it. I'll be right back. Alright guys. Here it is. So it's it's in pen. So what I did was I I drew it with marker, then I erased. I mean, I drew it with pencil. Then I erased all the pencil, and then I colored it in and um, did it again, but with pen. So you see, he's got the little hand. He's reaching out for you. Got this one, just like that. Looks like he's walking towards you because that feet is kind of back there. Then he's got this one forward towards you. This little kneecap things. The hole in his tummy. Um, the little stitches. Um, he's got the eyes and his mouth opened. Mm. And he does have a brain inside there. He's still living. So yeah. Um, guys, I think that's gonna be it for this video. So, hope you guys enjoyed and I'm sorry for making you guys wait a whole weekend for me to upload a new video it's been a long weekend and a lot of fun 
Got to eat some crab legs and some donuts. We're going to go to Dunkin' Donuts. We went to Dunkin' Donuts. And Saturday, I actually had some... I tried my first salad. You're welcome, Adam. <laughs> it was like... It was... Well, I haven't tried salad before. So I had um, some lettuce, carrots... And a dressing. Yeah. It's not something I would have all the time, though. And then I also had some shrimp. I think I like the garlic shrimp more than any other shrimp. And then I had some crab legs. Love seafood. All right, well, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe, click the like button, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.